Hi guys, Wayne Coast 713. Um, I'm gonna show you how to play Mafia, but um, it's not exactly gonna be anything visual. So um, so you you'll just have to listen to me. But um, I really like this card game Mafia, and I might try to figure out how to do it on Discord too, so that we can play it virtually. Um, but it's a really fun card game, and I'm here to tell you how to play it. Zombie Apocalypse <laughs> So, um, you'll need, so if you're doing this in person, if you're doing this in person, you'll need a deck of cards. And, um, you, you, if you want to use the additional roles that I'm going to explain, you will need the Joker. But normally, if you, if you're just playing without any additional roles, you don't need a Joker. So, um, so... You need um, at least the 52 cards, but you're not going to use all 52. So, um, so how it works is um, you, you need one person to be a moderator, and you need to have at least um, five players to play, but ideally you want to have more. And one in three players are Mafia, and Mafia is bad. Um, so, um, basically... What happens is, I, like I said, so if you have six players, you're going to have two Mafia people. Two players are going to be Mafia. But um, as far as stealing out the cards, the moderator is going to like choose all the roles for people. The people will get their roles and, and not, um, they cannot tell anyone else their roles until they die. So, um, basically what happens is the aces are Mafia. So if you get an ace, you're a Mafia. If you get, um, a king, then you're a sheriff. And if you're a queen, you get, um, the doctor. Now, I throw in two additional roles called Vigilante and Lawyer. The Lawyer is a Jack and the Vigilante is the Joker. And then, anyway, um, the number cards, 2 to 10, those are just townspeople. But if you don't throw in any additional roles, the jack is also considered townspeople. Or townspersons, civilians, citizens, whatever, whatever you call them. So, I guess it's a team-based game. So, you've got the mafia versus the, the innocents. And, um, so, everyone gets, um... Once everyone gets their card, the narrator tells everyone to go to sleep. So they put their heads down like this. And then they wake up like this when they're told to. So it, there's night and day. So at night, only certain people wake up. The citizens never wake up, but the mafia and the, like the doctor and the sheriff, they wake up. And then the, um, any additional roles can wake up after them. Um, and then afterwards, everyone wakes up. The, the moderator comes up with a funny story about what happens, what happened. And then everyone discusses who they think is Mafia and um, votes, votes someone out. The majority of votes then dies and reveal, and flips his card over to, um, to, um, show what he was also like if the mafia killed because mafia will kill someone too um if they are a part of it you know they get killed during the night they also flip their card over so when they flip their card over um it shows what um they were so um so basically everyone so i'm going to just implement this so i'm going to explain what the roles do so um if you're mafia then you know who the other Mafia members are, and you must work as a team to, um, basically to kill all the innocents until it's, until it's down to, until the number of innocents is equal to the number of Mafia. Then you guys win. So, um, so you have to silently agree to kill someone every night, and then when you, 
when you wake up, you're allowed to talk, but you have to try to deceive people and frame an innocent. And they, it, the, the townspeople will simply do the work for you if you are able to fool them. And um, then, anyway, after the daytime, it goes back to night and the whole thing restarts. So, and I forgot to say the, the innocents win if they kill all the mafia. If they vote all the mafia out, they win. So, um, so yeah, that's, that's, um, that, that's how, um, so that's how that works. Um, so, so anyway, the sheriff, so the sheriff, um, went, or sorry, I'll start with the doctor and then go to the sheriff. So the doctor gets to save someone. So, um, now the doctor's usually allowed to save himself, but um, what I sometimes do is make it so that he can only save every few nights himself. When, when, so, like, there's a, I, I make it so that, so I sometimes would make it, and you guys could do it too, where there's a cooldown for doctors saving themselves. So, when the cooldown is active, they have to save someone else other than themselves. But anyway, um, they, they try to save who they think the mafia is going to target. And then, that means if they save them, they don't die from the Mafia. Or the Vigilante, if you implement the Vigilante. Um, well, the order I do things in when I play Mafia is, I have the Mafia wake up and kill. And then the, the doctor does his thing, then the sheriff, then the Vigilante, and then the um, lawyer. And then everyone wakes up. So anyway, the... Um, if the doctor saves the wrong person, then the the person that ma the mafia voted to kill will die. So then the sheriff, the sheriff gets to investigate. So the sheriff gets to decide. Um, he gets to um, decide which which person to investigate, and he will know right away. As the, so, as the moderator, you give them a thumbs up or a thumbs down. You can also do this or this to represent, um, so you can, you can, you can do head gestures or you can give them a thumbs up and a thumbs down. So, as the, as, so the moderator tells the sheriff if they are or not. But then the challenge for the, so the sheriff can easily, you know, investigate one person who they think might be mafia and if they're right then yeah so they will know though so if they're if they're mafia or not and then they have to try to convince people when everyone wakes up that that person is or is not mafia but it's going to be hard because um you can't give away your role because then the mafia will want to kill you <laughs> if you're you know an innocent with a special role so then, um, so then the vigilante can, can kill people as well, but he does it solo. So he'll wake up after the sheriff investigates and then go and kill who he thinks is mafia. Now, the vigilante is an innocent. He's a good guy. Even though he wakes up and kills like mafia, he wakes up and can kill whoever he thinks is mafia, um, so he puts the, basically, just like the term suggests, he puts the law in his own hands. So, um, so basically, um, without the town approval, he, he'll go out in the middle, he'll wake up in the middle of the night when everyone else is asleep and, uh, murder who he thinks is Mafia. Right after Mafia makes their murder. But, oddly enough, the doctor can save them. Well, yeah. So I know it's kind of inconvenient because the doctor goes and tries to save after the mafia makes their kill, but um, but the doctor, but yeah, if if you if the doctor goes before the vigilante, but if the doctor saves the wrong person, but the vigilante goes and kills that person, the doctor will already be there to save them. So um, it, to put it that way, and um, and. All these roles that I've added in, the two the two extra roles and the default roles, they can all vote in the daytime. 
So then the um, the lawyer gets to it, it, he's kind of like the doctor, so he can also so he can actually defend someone. So the lawyer can um, basically protects them from being voted out in the daytime when they wake up. So he doesn't protect them from night killings like mafia or vigilante, but he can he can protect them he can protect them from being like if they receive the most votes they won't die and, the, and again that you can set up some sort of system for um if because the, the lawyer can also defend itself but um so that means he can never be voted out but um that's also not good because then the mafia will suspect that you know you're the lawyer and they could they could take you out so if you could set you could set up some sort of like limit for saving yourself or defending yourself. So um, so yeah, the lawyer was the lawyer. The reason why I did the lawyer is because he's interesting. With he or she, yeah, the lawyer. The lawyer can defend um, either himself or someone else um, when they all wake up and you know the night the night killings happen. Um, they all go and vote. You know who they think. Is mafia and uh, let's just say they all think that this one person is mafia. They'll go, they'll go and vote him out, but then he doesn't die because the the lawyer defends him. Now you could have it so, so that um, they all know ahead of time that the mysterious lawyer defended him and cannot be voted, or you can reveal that afterwards so that they say they all voted him to to um. They all voted him to, they all voted him out of the game, but because the lawyer defended him, he's not out of the game. Or he or she, sorry. But anyway. Um, so yeah, and there, you, you can have other additional roles, like I've seen like zombies and stuff. Like, um, and then, um, if that sounds too violent, because this is a kid-friendly channel after all, if it sounds too violent, there is a less violent version called Werewolves. Now, I don't know if werewolves, werewolves is less violent, but, um, it doesn't, it, it, it sounds more, like, medieval than it does, than Mafia. Mafia sounds like it's, like, modern times, like, um, like, yeah. But, with werewolves, the werewolves is essentially the Mafia. They're the, they're, they're wolves at night, and, um, humans in the day and then instead of a sheriff you have a seer and a seer can like look can predict the future can like just see the future for for that one person that he chooses and um instead it, it, you would still have a doctor and a vigilante well you could call the vigilante a hunter if you want to and then you you would call the um if you use the vigilante, um, and if you use the lawyer, you could call him the protector. And the the other people are still called townspeople, villagers, or whatever. All they can do is they they sleep through the entire night. The townspeople, no matter what game it is, they 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 stay they stay asleep the entire night and only wake up and vote who they think is mafia. But they're still important. If if you get if you get um. If you get um, civilian, you don't have to be upset because they're actually important too. Because they they don't have anything to do with the night, so um, they are the ones that try to help you know convince everyone else that so and so is mafia. So um, yeah, it can get more complicated than that, but um, but yeah. So if you're doing it on Discord, um, I guess you could use like the Deafen. It is possible to do it on Discord. So uh, what you could do is you would have to set up a bunch of private chats. The narrator would have to DM everyone their own roles or their roles so they couldn't tell anyone. And then um, everyone would deafen and then the, the, the moderator would undeafen the people when it's their turn, you know, for, for, their, for their night roles. And then undeafen everyone once the night has passed. And when the daytime thing happens, but, um, 
the problem with that is you can see who's deafened and undeafened, so you'd have to like minimize Discord as well. And um, it's like you couldn't have it open, so I, I would try. I'll try to figure it out, but um, I was thinking I haven't done a live stream yet. I'm still trying to figure out how to do a live stream, but um, I, I showed this to BW King 16 and he liked it, so we could. It, it, it might be on his channel too, but we might do like a we might do a live stream for for that game virtually. So if you're doing it virtually, you don't have any cards, so you just would DM him on Discord. Hey, you're you're mafia, or hey, you're you're a civilian. Don't tell anyone <laughs> until you're dead. And then when they're dead, you know, as a moderator, you just tell them the role that they were. And I forgot to say, if you're dead, you can't tell anyone you're, you're, you can't tell anyone, um, but you can tell people what you were, but, um, you don't have to be deafened or you don't have to go to sleep when you're dead. So you can see who the mafia is, you can see all the other roles, but you can't participate in the voting. You can't tell them what their roles are because you're already dead. Dead men tell no tales. So anyway, um, I'm sorry if I couldn't visual, visually show you, but anyway, um, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more, and until next time, Wayne Coast out.